Hey everyone, so I'm going to be doing a little new series called TV Talk. Um, basically I'm going to be talking about TV shows. Um, I thought what a better way to start this out than talk about a really popular show, um, The Secret Life of the American Teenager. Um, it actually premiered in 2008. It was a teenage pregnancy show and now it's created a big phenomenon and it's the final season. And the final season is named Together Forever. Um, so, some clues maybe? So, we don't know. Um, so basically I'm going to start out with this episode. Um, basically my background is I like Amy and Ben as a couple. Um, there's some problems with Ricky for me. Um, character development is huge for me and like kind of deciding where the characters are. Um, things like that. And this show could go on forever and ever and they should keep it going. Um, but they would not know who to base it on. Um, like if Amy's story's done and maybe Kathy's story should go on or like things are becoming a little more predictable like in the beginning but they need some twist which I'll be talking about. Um, there's one really good one. So this episode starts out with Kathy and Amy talking. Um, Kathy just gave up the baby for adoption um, in the Christmas episode and Kathy is going back to her parents. Um, Ethan also wants to go back down to Texas with her um, to talk to her parents tell them kind of like where he's at, um, things like that. He is not the father. Um, the father does show up in the next episode, um, things like that. Um, so basically, he's going and asking his foster parents about, like, can I go down asking permission, being very, like, noble, wants to do this, things like that. Shows a lot of guts, shows a lot of character development. Ethan's a character that he's very raw, but he's got that, like, smooth side to him, kind of, like, it's hard to explain, but it's like his character has, like, points missing to him, where you need to fill that in, um, he came off as a really horrible character, and now is, like, settling down, and I felt like him and Ricky are, like, the exact people, but I think Ethan's more a combination of Ben and Ricky, so, kind of interesting to see. Um, Kathy, I feel like there's part of her missing, like, there's a big chunk of her missing. Maybe when they go back down to Texas, there'll be, like, some big, like, oh, yeah, that's why. Um, so, yeah. Um, the next part of the episode is Amy and Ricky. Um, Amy buys a dress from a thrift store for, like, $25, and, um, she shows Ricky. Um, they are not married yet. Um, there was like a little fake, oh yeah, I can't believe we did that, I got married, and yeah, you're telling everyone you got married. Um, this is the confusing part. So they're not married at all. Um, so she shows him the dress, the dress is atrocious, even I think it is. Um, I watched a show called Something Borrowed on TLC, and I've seen dresses, well, in better shape than that, and I mean, them getting recreated in that, and I mean, like, that dress does not, the top and the bottom are two completely different things, like, the vision of it, um, things like that, um, and then there's another thing with all the ads for The Secret Life of the Te American Teenager, um, that they show Ricky and Amy, like, her in a short dress, and, um, Ricky in, like, a vest and a tie and that, and, like, the dresses, no, two completely different things, so there's something there. Um, and then Amy decides that she's going to show all of her friends the dress, um, which is kind of weird, like, I don't know, like, maybe the close girlfriends, but, like, she shows Adrian, she shows Grace and Jack, Omar, Omar knows it's a Haradara, which, that comes up, like, multiple times, she's like, it's Haradara, it's a Haradara, um, like, hmm, I've never heard of that designer, maybe it's a reference, reference to a designer. Um, there's, after that, she sends a, um, message, a picture message to Ben, um, of the dress, and Ben's kind of looking over it, um, Ben's, I, I just want to call her a sister, whatever, adopted sister, Chloe, um, she's like, yeah, I could read you, but she feels very stupid, um, there's part in here where the line is, um, it's like, what others want, you crack, or, yeah, you crack. So basically it's like the pressure on maybe Rick and Amy, like, the whole entire, um, like, I feel like in the series it is portrayed as, oh, you got, you're pregnant, now you used to have to get married in order to have a kid. Um, that showed very much between Ben and Adrian, and then it became an untwist. 
Um, so now it's like Ricky and Amy have their son, John. So they feel like, yeah, they have to get married, blah, 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 things like that. Um, I felt like there was never a big, like, attraction between Ricky and Amy. Um, like, even in the beginning, like, I felt like it was just a hookup and it became all this. Like, there was never, like, oh my god, he's so hot. Um, oh my god, like, he's so amazing. Like, things like that until, like, later on. And then, like, there's some things that are, like, hmm. Um, and then there's a lot of fights between Ricky and Amy. There's one on a trophy that Clementine had or something. Um, I didn't understand that quite well. Um, there's a thing about who is Robbie's dad again. Um, is it George or is it David? Um, David was one of the guys that Anne dated. Um, apparently David has twins. Um, are they his or are they someone else's? Um, so basically, um, and then Ashley was never shown in this episode. They never met, they mentioned her once. Um, so the next couple things are previews. Um, a little guesses I have, things like that. Um, if you guys don't want to watch any of this, turn it off. But if you want, like, spoilers or anything, these are all available to all of you. ABC Family commercials, things like that. Um, so basically, um, there are three engagements. So I'm figuring Adrian gets one. Um, Grace gets one, and Amy has one for sure. Um, but Grace might know that Amy and Ricky are not married. Um, there's more previews, like, in a big, like, episode, um, in the main, like, little commercial, they show, like, um, Amy sleeping on Ben's arm on an airplane, and, um, the little flight attendant asks, oh, does your, is your wife, whatever, okay, or something, and he just smiles, and he's like, yeah, and I'm like, that's a little, maybe a hint somewhere, like, um, it might be Ricky's ring on Amy's finger, or it might be Ben's ring on Amy's finger, so, could go both ways with that. Um, there was some very interesting previews in the next episode. Um, Ricky is talking with his counselor, and there's points where he's talking, where it's clearly, like, he's doubting himself, but then he's in it. There's key words in this conversation, but I want you guys to watch the conversation, that there's key words. This can be found on ABC Family, um... Basically, he's cracking and he's getting kind of nervous, um, like, is he in it for it all or not, um, kind of that doubt between getting married and not, things like that. Um, there is one with Grace and Jack, and basically, Jack basically wants, he's magically healed or whatever, and, um, he wants to cut his cast off, and he's like, I'm fine, I'm fine, I need to get back to football practice, and things like that. Um, and then there is a preview with Adrian and Omar, and apparently Omar gets a job or something, and Adrian's unloading groceries, and she pulls out a box, or she pulls out a box, and basically it cuts off when uh, Omar says it's a gift, and Omar, like, grabs her hands, and that's all you get to see, and I'm like, hmm, let's see if there's three proposals, let's figure it out. Um, that totally gives it away. Um, and then there's a huge hint when, um, Clementine, I think it is, and, um, Ricky are in bed together. Very interesting. I think both of them do have their clothes on or something. They're laying in bed and they're, like, facing each other. Um, but, like, there's key words in there that are, like, are you going to cheat on her, basically? Um, a lot of doubt in there. Things like that, like kind of upbeat in the air, like, hmm, 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 um, so yeah, there's, like, things that are kind of thrown off in that little commercial that was airing for, like, the longest time, they showed old, like, ones of, um, Ben and Amy hugging, if you look at, like, what she's wearing, and then look back to old episodes, um, yeah, it's not current, um, and then there's a part where, um, Amy's basically either getting a talk to by George or Anne, and he, she's like, or whatever, they're like, oh, you can't have everything. And she's like, I'm going to. Um, so what's her everything? Um, that's another part about it. Um, so that's pretty much all for this episode. So if you guys have anything you think is going to happen, um, any little previews, things like that, um, put them in the comments below. Um, if you don't want, if they're like little spoilers and you don't want other people to see, put like a ton of like 
stars or make them be like spoiler and caps anything like that um thank you guys so much for watching um any tv shows you want to hear about or anything we talk about um leave a comment below and thank you for watching bye